the end of the chapter. Bruce in a hoodie. Stack deck. Last name of a bar. twist in the race for the mayor's office as Harvey Dentbacker Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Of Mr. course. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as, well, the jealous sort. Very possessive of his toys. Better keep a low profile. Did you hear? You lost? Because I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for a woman. <laughs> you wouldn't be the first. Selena Kyle, I'm told she practically lives here. <laughs> Selena, huh? You don't strike me as her type. Uh, you'd be surprised. Hey, don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. The cops take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> Are you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low-lying type. Nice to meet you. Uh... Frank. Yeah. Funny seeing you here. So much in the papers. Whole other thing, meeting the man in real life. You're uh, shorter than I thought you would be. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. Well, I've met a couple of his goons myself. Your client isn't one for subtlety. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Ugh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. The Penguin. It's not my fault that you're in this, Selena, but I can help you out of it. Tell me what you know about Penguin. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. <laughs> The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? Oswald wanted Falcone out of the picture. Looks like he succeeded. So what? He wants to take his place? Maybe. For starters. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald... Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. I need you, Selena. That right? If Penguin is as <laughs> deadly as you say, I need all the help I can get. Bruce, sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. 
But what would Harvey think? The two of us, working together? After all, I'm not really an all-work-and-no-play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. I'm sorry, why, why are we talking about Harvey? He's your friend, isn't he? Just seeing how much of a conscience you really have. You and I... Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. Beat it. We're here for her. If you care about your own skin, you'll get the hell out. She's with me. I think you need to leave. There we go. Where'd it go, Selena? table. Not done yet. Come on. Pretty well choreographed stuff here. put together stuff I think they want more then let's give it to them Pretty good stuff. You fight pretty good for such a pretty boy. Phone. Come on, this way. Stack deck. I like that. It's a good bar name. Let's get out of here. I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Yes or no, will you help me stop Penguin? I'm gonna say maybe. 
But only because he's trying to kill me. Pretty good reason to say yes. You shouldn't trust me, you know. Alfred, I'm uploading Batman the made a friend. to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Uh, processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Hill's a son of a bitch. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but... If I may offer a word of advice. People look up to Batman after how you handle Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Ah, oh, no, I'm going as Batman. Going as Batman is the sure bet. A little tired of playing as Bruce Wayne. I want to play as some Batman. Batman has the public trust after taking down Falcone. Try not to throw it away by going overboard on Hill. Battering the mayor is not a good option. Don't worry, Alfred. I'm a light touch when I need to be. <laughs> the city will thank me later if Hill tells me Penguin's plans. Deborah, you incompetent! Dents up in the polls. I need to crucify him in the debate or we can kiss re-election and your job goodbye. You'd better be back here in the next 15 minutes. I'm cutting your pay. Who's that? Deborah. Deborah. Is that you? You know who I am. It's time we finally met. Oh! Batman? What are you doing here? You know who Penguin is. So I've heard of him. So what? I've got nothing to do with that lowlife. Do you hear me? You think people will still vote for you when you've got no teeth left? I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Wayne, there's the real problem. He's the one you should be after. Every fiber of his being built on lies, his status, his fortune. Nice try, but Bruce Wayne is clean. No one born into a pile of crap that deep can come out clean. I witnessed firsthand the atrocities of his family, and he's the one who profited. <gasps> Security! Pick up, goddammit! Security! Don't kill me! I've done nothing wrong! You can't keep secrets from me. I always find the truth. What the hell are you talking about? Penguin wants revenge for what happened to his mother. Thomas Wayne sent her to Arkham, along with who knows how many other innocents. Nothing was wrong with any of them. 
until Thomas locked them up. Something mm. this big couldn't have been hidden. There'd be records. With enough money, you can make anything or anyone disappear. I didn't dare speak up. Whatever happened in the past, it's nothing compared to what's happening now. Penguin isn't the only child of Arkham. There are others whose families were destroyed by Wayne. They'll make Gotham pay for his sins. <gasps> no. Please. Don't. No. They'll have to go through me first. If I hadn't given Penguin what he wanted, he would have struck at the debate tonight. I didn't just do this for myself. I'm trying to protect Gotham. Finally. About damn time. It's Batman! Shoot him! Come on, get the mayor out of here! That's the appropriate response. Always shoot the Batman. I heard everything, Master Bruce. What he said about your father it must be difficult to process. I need to know what went on in Arkham Asylum. Uh, indeed. I'm just as frustrated as you are. No, you're not. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. Is that the end of the chapter? The episode, rather? Yeah, it was the end of the chapter. Is there six chapters or five, though? is on here. As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. But Gordon heard about Batman's surprise visit to the mayor. He was far from happy. Thanks for the heads up. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now more than ever. Uh... I'll, uh, leave you to it then. Mm, what are we looking at here? District Attorney Harvey Dent appears to be hitting some potholes on his path to the mayor's office. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff and making ad buys. A Dent spokesperson said these rumors are nothing more than a smear tactic perpetuated by the incumbent Mayor Hill's campaign. In other news, nobody goes to Gotham's dive bars mm. expecting a quiet night out. But police say a brawl tonight at the Stack Deck Bar in Otisburg was the rowdiest one in recent memory. Reports say multiple arrests were made, with all the suspects taken into custody while Gotta clear all these exclamation police points out here. Identified man and woman who were seen in conversation with the assailants shortly before the fight. Gotham Need to clear all these out. So it was something worthwhile happens. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors persist that the candidate is having trouble paying his campaign staff and making ad buys. A Dent spokesperson said these rumors are nothing more than a smear tactic perpetuated by the incumbent Mayor Hill's campaign. In other news, nobody goes to Gotham's dive bars expecting a quiet night out. But police say a brawl tonight at the Stack Deck Bar in Otisburg 
was the rowdiest one in recent memory. Reports say multiple arrests were made with all the suspects taken. There we go. Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguins no shit. may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at what they want us to see. Warn Gordon that he may have visitors. I have to get down there now. to get out of there. Hey, Bruce. Voicemail. Man, I'm glad you called. <laughs> nope. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's... Well, it's, it's... Har Harvey, listen to me. Your life is in danger. Because of Penguin and his thugs? Thanks, but there is an army of security here. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of overkill, if you ask me. It's not overkill, Harvey. It's a real... Please. I need to get this off my chest. Uh, look. Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but... My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Until all this mess with your family blows over. They're afraid it's... I, I get it. It's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. <laughs> but here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public. But you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. Forget your campaign for a minute. The money won't matter if you're dead. Yeah, well, until I am, it is still my primary concern. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we wanted. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> I guess she needs to put on my face. I hope uh -oh. you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember. You are always my friend. Harvey! How weird that their mouths look a little photorealistic, like the lips and the teeth, but everything else does not. Batman. Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. But just so we're clear, you and me. We're on shaky ground. Jim, listen. No, listen to me. The excessive violence, it, it can't go on. What excessive violence? Most of the GCPD already think you're a monster. Don't prove them right. You're lucky I'm on your side. Now that may be true, but I can't ally with a violent thug. What we excessive have violence? We to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? I think she's mending her ways. Oh, he's right, Lieutenant. I don't do the bad things anymore. Unless it's on request. Uh, this better not come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, come in. I just wonder what that fucking ended. excessive violence. Incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. 
I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. Doing the right thing? Maybe there's hope for you yet. Don't read too much into it. I'm just allergic to owing you anything. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? Now uh, you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. Yeah, we are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dent, Lieutenant. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates, incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hill and the challenger Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. And it's also important for you, the citizens of Gotham, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a city that's faced its share of hardships in recent years. Rising crime rates, income inequality, and yes, a massive vigilante loose on our streets. The candidates will tackle it all. There you go, take them out. Bunch of dead cops. At least we know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. So sorry, ladies and gents. As you might have guessed, there's been a change to tonight's program. First order of business. Firing the moderator. Wow. I hate to be a downer. Harsh. These hostages. I don't like their chances. Oh, they just didn't have a head for the issues. If we're quick and decisive, no one else has to die. If you say so. But Penguin's playing for keeps. Fanatics always do. <gasps> You'll do. Get out here. Keep it quiet back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. You. Thank you for volunteering. Wait. Please. No. Go on, then. Introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right, I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Got to take them out quietly. On the left. Oh, the hot, soft, Do this again. That's quiet. Okay, so that's...
Inquisition. Catwoman. If you say so. Ask that guy. Mm, all right, I think that's the best way to do it. for help. Nobody died, right? Do we do it right? Do we do it with nobody dying? Keep your rights down. Make for the police line. And now, a word from our sponsor. My Delta, brothers and sisters of God, you have nothing to fear. We are the children of Arkham. We are here to end the masquerade and expose the corruption that's ruined your city. So who is Oswald working for? Men like your esteemed mayor have profited from the pain of innocence. I knew this was too big for Oswald alone. Someone else is pulling the strings. Smart. Let someone else do the dirty work. Look into the hearts of these spineless creatures. Go on, love. You know what to do. Ah! Candidates, take off your masks. <laughs> what do we have here? What is this? Subject nine. Thomas Wayne. Dad. I thought your father was dead. Subject nine. Esther Cobblepot. You've been declared criminally insane and committed to Arkham indefinitely as a ward of the state. Please. I'll sell you the land. Please don't do this. You had your chance. You should have made the deal we offered you. Give her the drug. Thomas, we were... We're friends. Our boys play together. You were warned, Esther. You know I always get what I want. Commence the procedure. How poorly rendered everyone is, except for Wayne.
Birdman! You certainly know how to make an entrance. Here, Vicky. Or get him. Go! Why don't you kick the crap out of here? No, please, I'm in the hand. You could never. Kidneys, he's weak in the kidneys, apparently. I took out Thomas Wayne. That, 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 that was all him. He didn't know when to stop. I had him killed because of it. They won't bring back my poor old mum. So this is for her. How about you kill anyone else? Why, your turn, Dent. Damn. Short circuit his brain. Bruce Wayne, your biggest supporter, and he didn't even turn up. <laughs> Batman! The revolution's already started! It's too late to join! Let Dent go. And what if I do? I'll crush every bone in your body. I knew you'd say something like that. Oh, come on. This is easy. I gotta... I gotta save Selena because I gotta let Harvey become Two Face. Shooting a Batman, damn it. And the cops learned. Two face. Harvey. That's a hell of a burn, man. The maniac in the mask? We need paramedics over here. Now. I had to let it become two face. Well, that and I like that one. Is in so. chaos after that was a pretty Hamilton easy choice. Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. He won't be the same after this. No shit. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued. Look at his to face. After the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. <laughs> this injured is so bad.
representing Bruce Wayne have no comment at this time. We are the children of Arkham, and we have opened your eyes. So I wonder who they are. I wonder who the children of Arkham are. See, most people have the hots for Selena. I'm surprised more people didn't go as Batman. Most people continue to fund the campaign because most people like Bruce to be a good guy. Who understands things. Yeah, see, most people save Selena. Most people go and save the woman. I think I think that 36% down there just uh, don't like the Two-Face character. Because that was my decision. I wanted Harvey to become Two-Face. But I also wanted to save Catwoman. Because I like the Catwoman character better. So that's my explanation. All right, next time on. Next time on Batman, the Telltale series. You may have saved me, but this isn't over. You don't know these people, Bruce. Authorities are scrambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy. Still no sign of their masked leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is, who's next? After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham, sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now... They want to decide what your future at this company will be. Do you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting? What do you want from me? You know what I want. No more hiding, but for anyone. But don't worry, Bruce Wayne's finally gonna get what's coming to him. Bruce! Bruce! Who's the boss, man? Alright, that'll do it for episode two of Batman the Telltale series. Um, I'm not sure what episode this is going to come out to on the playlist. Probably four would be my guess. But uh, I'm going to take a quick break, get myself something to drink again. No food this time. And uh, jump back into this uh, for... Another couple hours. Probably, we'll probably get episode 3 accomplished today. And that'll be it. But uh, so far I'm enjoying it. It's it's not without its problems. Especially graphically. Uh, the number of people whose faces haven't been fully rendered. Is uh, kind of disturbing. The shadows at the beginning of this episode. Were the big roving black spots. That uh, obscured a lot of what was going on in the opening of the episode. And then of course in the first episode. When uh, old Bruce's head was on backwards. But apart from those issues, this game has been pretty good so far, um, and I'm looking forward to see looking forward to see what comes next. But uh, just sit tight. If you're watching this on YouTube, jump forward to the next installment. I'll be right back. Just uh, give me a minute, and I'll be back with more. <laughs>